hi! Welcome to my class. Our topic for today is about functions and equations. We're going to find out how to write an equation to represent a function, and we are going to graph linear function. Now, let us consider this question. Write an equation to represent a function shown in the table. You can see that the input is x, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and the output is y. If x is 1, y is 5. If x is 2, y is 10. And so on. Let us put the table this way. The input, the function, and then the output. Let us find out why when the input is 1, the output becomes 5. When the input is 2, the output becomes 10. When the input is 3, the output becomes 15. And so on. Did you find out why? We multiply the input by 5. Check it. 1 times 5 is 5. 2 times 5 is 10. 3 times 5 is 15. 4 times 5 is 20. And 5 times 5 is 25. It's correct, right? So we were able to find out the equation. The value of y is equal to 5 times the value of x. Therefore, the equation that represents the function is y is equal to 5x. Now, let us consider this question. Graph y when it is equal to 3x. What are we going to do? It's the same step. Make a table of ordered pairs, select any three values of x, and substitute the va these values for x to find out y. Let us put the table this way so that it will be easy for you. Let us assign the value of x from 1 to 3 only. So, to find the function, 3 times 1, 3 times 2, and 3 times 3, and we can find out the y. So, from the following values of x that we assigned, we find out that y is equal to 3, 6, and 9. Now, let us put the values of x that we assigned and the values of y that we have found out in the xy column. These are the ordered pairs. Now, we can graph each ordered pair. We can draw a line through each point. As you can see from the graph, when x is 1, y is 3. When x is 2, y is 6. And when x is 3, y is 9. And this is the graph of y is equal to 3x. It's easy. What about this question? Graph y when x is equal to 1. What are you going to do? It's the same step. Make a table of ordered pairs, select any three values of x, and then substitute these values of x to find y. As you can see, I assigned x as 1, 2, and 3 again. I substitute the x from the equation. So, 1 plus 1 is equal to what? 2 plus 1 and 3 plus 1. And we can find out y from this equation. From the assigned values of x, we can find out y. So, y is equal to 2, 3, and 4. Now, we can list down the ordered pairs from the xy column. When x is 1, y is 2. When x is 2, y is 3. And when x is 3, y is 4. It's easy. What are you going to do next? We are going to graph each ordered pair. We're going to draw a line through each point. As you can see from the graph, when x is 1, y is 2. When x is 2, y is 3. And when x is 3, y is 4. This is the graph of y is equal to x plus 1. Very easy, right? Math is really easy. Till next lesson. Bye-bye.